理想は権利を置いて。I'm always、um, when she preparing for the questions,、uh, uh, exercise for the brain to think about what are the we read or read in the Bible. So again,、uh, when she preparing, refreshing our brains to get something very special, especially language values. <laughs> Most of our, not、uh, our mother language in English, we are not in study. So, what are the we need in Canada? Language, English or French. So, we are practicing through Sister Lily our language ability. Understanding, reading, yeah, this is very good exercise for the brain. And、um, next Sunday, A little bit、uh, special, a little bit special Sunday because of the b a b a No, but after, after Sunday,、um, not this week. Yeah, next Sunday. Yes, after. Next Sunday, next. Next Sunday, last Sunday. In two weeks. Two weeks. Next to next Sunday. 29. No, I'm just I'm confused. <laughs> <laughs> next to next after、Sunday. that, I will be t a l k i n g After the service. Okay, that's true. And today, Brother c o l i u s I am not going to go for the long months.、Uh, I want to be short. <coughs> Definitely, I am going to stop it before six. Because、uh, Pastor k r i s a n t h a s already made a wonderful worship time and the sermon as well, including package that、uh, what he did today. So beautiful when I am hearing. Um, Apostle Paul and Silas, so what happened t h e m to in prison? It's a huge story. How they face <laughs> the situation hard. Then their attitude is a huge lesson. To, even today, we have to, we have to think about the First century Christians, how much sacrificed their life to bring gospel today for us is the hardest century, first century Christians' lives. So, that's completely explaining the situation t h e n our schools, the episodes explaining. Those conditions. Today I am doing very something very special. At a, at a video. You know, in the Bible, Psalm 139, verse 14. Mentioned some things very huge about human life. Psalm 139 was 
Right, that's the one of the I need was then Hindi, Tamil. Thirteen also you can read it, yeah. Then another language we have already. Mathiratan, Karanga, Anjam, Yu Jo Ma, Piana Riti, So you formed my inward parts. Yes. You covered me in my mother's womb. Yes. I will praise you for I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Marvelous are your works, and that my soul knows very well. Fearfully and wonderfully made in my mother's womb. Wow. So, then you know it. So it has an official language in Quebec, <laughs> French, 139 was uh, 13 and 14. Qui m'a tissé dans le sein de ma mère, je te loue de ce que je suis, une créature si merveilleuse. Tes œuvres sont admirables et mon âme le reconnaît bien. I hope every language mentioned the same was in Sinhala, English, Tamil, Hindi, Punjab, French. Now please come to another one part of that same portion, verse 16. The same portion, verse 16. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yes. In Punjab, Hindi. Teriya akha ne mere bedol malve nu vekhya ate teri poti vich o sab likhe gaye din me din mithe gaye jad ohna vichon ik vi nahi si. En karuvai ummudiya kangal kandadu en avayavangalil onraagilum illada pole avaygal Anaitum, Avegal Uruva, Uruvera Petra Nartkanam, Umadapusta till Eladi Rikred. Wow. Terry Uncle named Mere Bendo, Tanuko, Tavuko, Teka, or in Mere Sub Ango, Jodin Din Ban Bante Jate, where Rache Janese Pale, Terry Pustak Milike Wete. Right, and I make a one and a second to Janina, the Hapla and Tokoko. It's very, very clear here. The creator of the human, he has a blueprint about the human body parts, how have to make the human. I was 18. There is a book for him to already design the human body, how he, he or she good and the wonderful person. So when you are, when I am here right now, we cannot understand this subject, how we came to this world through our mother's womb. But the creator of the human has a huge plan. Is not he got a quick decision or sudden decision to make human? 
over a long term plan. Jeremiah chapter 1 verse 5. Do everybody very clearly knows. Before I conceive my mo I, my mother's womb, yes, you know me. Can you, can you, can you come back, please? So I'm not connected to this and to that and another one verse before you go to that. See that uh, video deep. Jeremiah chapter 1 verse 5. Before I formed you in the womb, I knew you. Before you were born, I sanctified you. I ordained you a prophet to the nations. Aha! Uh -huh. Before, before I conceived my mother's womb, where I am. Koheda mama hitiye. Magi, am magi, but it's a mama in the Kalin Kilapi, Sindhuin Kilapi. Make a piece, call a gale, Kunu Harapaki, or Polo Tech, but make a dollar me. Kadaka. There is uh, so much uh, funny things uh, going on in this school time when we are talking. A big common, how we can come to our mother's womb. How we are formed in our mother's womb. Here, Jeremiah chapter 5, verse, verse 1, chapter 1, verse 5 said, Before. Then please come, Ephesians chapter 1, verse <coughs> 3 and 4. Ephesians chapter 1, verse 3 and 4. Again, I need all the language. Because, uh, uh -huh. So, but now I want to mention 
once again, he fearfully and wonderfully made, made us in our mother's womb. David, he saw in vision how mothers conceiving, how that seeds together growing in mother's womb, how the child slowly growing in mother's womb. He doesn't have, as Pastor Krasant has mentioned, his worship time, many technological equipments those days, uh, but the vision clearly mentioned to him too, how this scientific matter happening in other mother's womb. There is a purpose before the lay down of foundation of the earth. He made us, he chose us, he called us to be a human for him. Sister, you, did you read it in English? It? No, you didn't read it. Sister, the God and the Father of yes. our Lord Jesus Christ, who have blessed us with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in Christ. Before one? No, after, after. Okay. According as He had chosen us in Him, before the foundation of the world, before. that we should be holy and without blame before Him in love. Holy and blameless people He needed. But he chose us, select us before the foundation of this world. Word one word there, Romans chapter 8, verse 28. Predestined, predestination. Before he made this universe, earth. He has a plan about you and me. Because of this purpose. Many of the people come to Christ Stay in church, why? Little while laughter, you cannot see them anymore. Even we are trying to get them back as his love, his caring, his compassion, giving them. No, they are not turning back to the Bible, back to the church. But some, when they heard about Jesus, when they accepted Jesus Christ, very easily starting that growing process, facing every kind of uh, human distraction, problem in the church and the outside as a Christians, but never ever they are leaving church and the Christ. Imagine the secret of that in this verses he mentioned. How people, some are, can stick with the church and the Christ and the, his fellow people. How some are very easily left out in from the church, even they get it benefit, get it healing, get it blessing. Fan about you and me. He personally select me and you. Those people you know, 
Biology, he, he, he got the biology, uh, microbiology degree in Columbia University. He has a biological knowledge. When he teaching to the teacher, uh, teaching to the students, that part came for the human, how human are generating human, how get the, the, the birth through the mother's womb. So gen, uh, uh, um, the man and woman they are, they, are, they, are, they, are, they are consuming together the, the, the sexual uh, ability to woman and man come together. <coughs> then he explained to the one point, when that the man's seed goes to the fallopian tube, there is a time period that is staying the, the <coughs> woman's seed, waiting the man's seed come in fallopian tube. He mentioned this wonderful place in this video clip, mentioning it, the how long that 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 the, the woman seed is staying <coughs> and becomes man seed in, in conceived together is thirty hours. What he said, you are not going to come to this world as a proper baby. That something not coming from universe to connect this relationship, woman seed and the man seed. He said, "This not in this curriculum. You cannot find this verse from this your biological books. What are you are preparing for the exam? This is." I got some significant things from universe, this Buddhist man, <coughs> universe, human waiting, human, human are before human made, uh, come to form as a baby, something they need come from above, come from supernaturally, become a uh, this uh, processing properly word. When I heard it a year ago, I was so surprised. He talking about that our the universe created human creators, uh, the the power of the human creating. So when you are when you are watching this video clip, you can see how you and me create fearful. And wonderfully, with the, his purpose for this world to fulfill his desire. Yes, During ejaculation, nearly 300 million sperms move from the testes through the tubes called the vas deferens into the area of the prostate. At this point, the prostate contracts closing off the opening between the bladder and the urethra, releasing fluid into the urethra and pushing semen on through. The seminal forms a thick fluid that is alkaline in order to protect sperm from the acidic environment of the female vagina. The gel is liquefied by enzymes from the prostate gland. It also contains sugars to nourish the sperm. 
the seminal plasma is left in the vagina. Sperm use their tails to swim through the layers of cervical mucus that guard the entrance to the uterus. During ovulation, this barrier becomes thinner and changes its acidity, creating a friendlier environment for the sperm. On the other side, after releasing the egg at about day 14 of the period, the egg arrives at a specific portion of the tube called the ampular ismic junction. It rests for another 30 hours. Fertilization occurs in this portion of the tube. Once the sperm has entered the uterus, contractions propel the sperm upward into the fallopian tubes. To meet the waiting egg, sperm must travel from the vagina to the fallopian tubes, a tough journey that few sperm survive. This process may be nature's way of allowing only the healthiest sperm to fertilize the egg to provide the best chances of having a healthy baby. The first sperm enter the tubes a few minutes after ejaculation. But, however, the first sperm are not likely to fertilize the egg. Mobile sperm can survive in the female reproductive tract for up to five days. The magic happens in the fallopian tubes. The fallopian tube pushes the egg towards the uterus. Cilia push the sperm towards the egg. Also, the surrounding cells of the egg produce a chemical that attracts sperm. The sperm first burrow through the cells of the corona radiata. Then, upon contact with the zona pellucida, the sperm bind to the receptors in the zona pellucida. Then, the enzyme-filled cap of the sperm, called the acrosome, releases its stored digestive enzymes. Finally, the sperm must fuse with the egg plasma membrane. This event causes the egg membrane to change and prevent other sperm from attaching to it. Now attached, the sperm's nucleus, where the chromosomes are stored, enters the egg cell, looking for the egg's nucleus. Egg combines genetic material with the sperm to create a full set of chromosomal DNA with 23 pairs of chromosomes that contain a unique copy of half the genes of the parent source. This is the blueprint for a whole new unique person that instantly determines gender, hair color, eye color, and many other characteristics. The combined sperm and egg is called a zygote. It is the earliest developmental stage. It divides rapidly in the days following fertilization. The zygote then travels down the fallopian tube to the uterus. After fertilization, the zygote continues to divide and morph into a blastocyst ball of 16 cells, approximately five to six days after fertilization. It is smaller than the tip of a ballpoint pen. Only 20% to 30% of fertilized eggs will reach the blastocyst stage. Embryos that survive this stage of development have a high implantation potential once transferred into the uterine cavity. The blastocyst hatches out of its shell and burrow into the uterine wall, endometrium, which serves as the source of oxygen and nutrients. About four weeks from the beginning of the last period, near the next period, the blastocyst has begun to produce the pregnancy hormone to tell your ovaries to stop releasing eggs. From then on, the menstrual cycle pauses. The blastocyst is called an embryo now. Home pregnancy tests might be able to get a positive result. At week five, the circulatory system, brain, and spinal cord are beginning to form and the tiny heart will start to beat. The baby's heart beats about 54 million times before birth. 
The placenta provides oxygen and nutrients to the growing baby and removes waste products from the baby's blood via the umbilical cord. The nose, mouth, and ears are starting to shape at week six. At weeks seven and eight, the embryo has doubled in size since last week's. Little hands and feet start to grow. At week nine to 12 of pregnancy, the embryo is called a fetus. The baby is almost fully formed and has completed the most critical portions. The facial features are more recognizable. The fetus's head is rotated and bent towards the chest, and he can occasionally touch his face. The diaphragm muscles start to grow. The reproductive, circulatory, and urinary systems are all at an advanced stage of development. The fetus will urinate in the amniotic sac. It is a sign of the proper functioning of the fetus's body. If the baby is a girl, her ovaries contain millions of eggs. If the fetus is a boy, his testicles will already start producing testosterone, male sex hormone, which is necessary for the development of his reproductive system. She or he is about five centimeters in size and 14 grams in weight. She or he is growing and maturing until ready to birth. Can we understand this huge processing matter in our small brain? Yes, gynecologists are doing such a great things to give it all that wise uh, make a healthy baby. Keep healthy baby until giving birth. <coughs> but David, uh, what he saw in his vision, the same whole picture how our human creator made me made you fearfully is something miss out baby doesn't want to come still birth in mother's womb or when he or she was burning both giving birth uh, the traveling can't get proper breathing so much issues how much things we have praise our human creator 
he fearfully and wonderfully made us for his purpose. As Ephesians chapter 1 verse 3 and 4 mentioned here, before his person, before his um, he, he, he foundation of the world, Normal. And of that words which is very clear, exactly single is we have that same words. The sanctified people, women, men and women, uh, he is searching to stay his presence. Uh, he made for that, he make decision for that before the foundation of the world and before we conceive our mother's womb. That much huge, that plan. So how we can get this picture clearly to surrender to our human creator fully and stay with him and his presence, keeping ourselves purifying, sanctifying, to give our holy presence, <coughs> holy worship for our human I would like to you meditate as like David meditate for this matter. We are not just by accident came to this world. We are. Maybe some are still in the outside world. They cannot, they didn't yet get the Christ. They didn't yet hear about Christ. When he heard about Christ, they run away, they come to his presence and try to grow in with his holiness, uh, who are the people even hurting her, him, coming to church, getting benefits, but not staying, you can, you can, you can think about that matter. That is a secret kind of. People are not getting properly it because people are still think who are the people came to this world through the mother's womb, they all can get salvation. But is not the truth. Truth is not. Who are the people before the foundation of the world? He chose them. People doesn't want to get in this they said this is the wrong idea. But my heart with the Holy Spirit so much agreed with this testimony. He already put his word. Every man and woman, his creation. He made them. But there is a difference calling and choosing. So that's why we are sometimes church leaders most of the time frustrated why people are not getting Lord Jesus grace and mercy. Why they are not staying in church. Why they fighting and lifting from the church. Why they don't, they don't want to get this eternal yeah. you can think about this matter much more deeply. One of the he's like a theologian he studied Bible very well go to theological college and all kind of degrees. Sri Lankan pastor. When I talked with the one day I talked 
this subject in my previous church. Immediately he came and after service he said, Pastor, don't preach like this preaching. It's not proper truth preaching. It's not the truth. Every human came to this world, they have to have ability to accept Jesus Christ. No any specific people he chose. Everybody has that opinion. When I again started this happened in 13 years ago, again start to read the Bible, ask for the spirit, it is the truth. Oh, this is the truth. In your Bible, you mention. Because I don't want to get it that refuse that idea. Because the theological degree, so much studied Bible map. But I couldn't find any, any, any proper proof for that. Finally, John chapter 17, verse 6, Jesus mentioned. That's the finally I found it to prove that Holy Spirit, what are the revealed to me, is truth. He said, Father, these people you gave to me, I didn't choose anyone. You, you gave to me. I proclaimed to them about you. They understood. They stayed with me. They belong to you. Jesus once again mentioned there is a heavenly father who has created purpose people to come and stay with you until they are last breath. Growing, sanctifying themselves, purifying themselves to come to his presence as a whole people. So even you can think about this idea. You can find other Bible evidence to tell me, no pastor is not true. There is any opportunity, any opportunity, any people to come to Christ. Yeah. Of course, can come to Christ. But who are the people who stay until they are the last breath with Christ? Those are the people. Those are the, he's talking about the, those are those people. Who are the people who stay in their last breath with Christ? With every hard time, good time. Everyone can come to Christ. That's true. But choose the calling and choose the people is there. Lord Jesus, thank you for this um, evening. David mentioned it. Jeremiah mentioned it. Apostle Paul mentioning it. Jesus calling Father, I am not the man choosing these 12 or other people you gave to me. You choose. So, stay <coughs> on. Still, you are creating people in Mother's womb. They are coming to this world. But there is a number of people who have the label of Jesus. When they are hearing about Jesus Christ, they are coming. Stay with the whole life of the Lord. When Jesus so here you are people, Lord, today, listening this word. Holy Spirit challenge it to you. Do you have that calling and you have that chosen labor? Oh, by accident we met Jesus. So we try to follow. Maybe he take in us or not. It's okay. We don't care about the eternal life or hell or heaven. Just life. We want to just something different. So that's why we are coming to church. Maybe you have like this kind of 
two kind of idea. As with the Holy Spirit, he's going to guide and direct you properly what the, his word he proves about choosing. Thank you.